The northern lights have been dancing across our skies long before people lived uh, anywhere near them. And since the arrival of the first people to the north, legends have grown about these mysterious, shifting lights. The Norse tell the story of the Valkyries, immortal women on horseback who would come galloping across the night sky, their helmets, spears, and armor glowing and shimmering in the darkness. In Roman mythology, Aurora is the goddess of the dawn who renews herself every morning to fly across the sky, announcing the arrival of the sun. The Arctic's indigenous peoples believed the lights were the spirits of the animals they had hunted. Seals, whales, salmon, and caribou. The Inuit of Hudson Bay dreaded the lights. They believed they were the lanterns of demons pursuing lost souls. The Menominee people thought the glow must be the torches of giants that lived in the north. And to this day, travelers from around the world come to northern Canada during the long winter nights, hoping that they will be lucky witnesses to these dancing lights. The local people tell them to gather at midnight, the best chance at seeing this elusive, natural wonder. On some nights, some say they hear a crackle in the air, the sound of aurora borealis, and maybe, just maybe, that sound is the voices of people who for centuries have stood in the same place, looked at the same sky, and talked in hushed voices at what they saw. No matter what the legend, what the myths, the Aurora Borealis is a beacon to the mystery, the wonder, and the majesty of the Canadian North.